Coming, coming. <laughs> uh, shit. Um, let me just. There. Um. Right. Uh. There. Okay. Yeah. Mhm. Mm yeah. Okay. That's all tidied up. Uh. Yeah. I said I'm coming. <laughs> Patience. <sighs> <clears throat> Hi. Oh my goodness. Welcome back. Of course I recognize you. How could I not recognize my very first customer? I am so happy to see you again. Couldn't resist staying away, huh? <laughs> Aren't you happy to find out that I am still in business even after those silly little complaints from the government? You know, but um, what are they going to do? Shut me down? <laughs> I'm not even in a legitimate business, so... What? No, um, no, that's... No, nothing. Um, welcome back. <laughs> yeah, no, I am so happy to see you again. Come in, come in. Don't mind the stuff in the hallway. I recently had a really big shipment and I still have to tidy some stuff up. But, um, just don't step on anything. It's gonna cost you. <laughs> yeah, oh, this is really expensive. Don't touch anything, okay? Good, good. Really good, really good. Oh my god, how have you been? I am so happy to see that you are still alive and kicking. <laughs> I mean, not everyone makes it in this world, you know? But to be fair, with the upgrades I gave you, well, I'd be surprised if you didn't make it. Yeah, I, I did you good. I did you good. Yeah. I mean, shit can fuck up on your first client, right? <laughs> yeah, that would be quite something. Hmm. Anyways. So. I just want to say beforehand that, um... Demand is up, and uh, I've been making quite a name for myself, you must have heard on the streets. Yeah, well, it's been lovely. People really enjoy my customer service. <laughs> and even though you still, by far, have the cutest and prettiest face that ever walked in here, unfortunately, I cannot just give you these things for free anymore. No, it's going to cost you. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. So it's either going to be some eddies or if you're not up for that, I could take some parts. Now, don't worry. Obviously, I'm not going to touch my own tech. <laughs> Would be a waste to install it and then take it away again. No, 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 no. I'm talking about something else entirely. You know, I have this new customer, client, whatever you want to call it. I have a buyer. And instead of the usual tech parts, this buyer is actually interested in bio parts. You'd be surprised. There's quite a market for it. All those silly little biological body stuffs that everyone just kind of keeps tossing away or flushing it down. Turns out it's actually quite rare in our modern society. And some people pay top money for some intact bio parts. So, if you're looking for some more tech and getting rid of some bio, well, I would argue that's probably a perfect trade, isn't it? You don't even have to do any of the hustle or hassle yourself. You just hand it over to me and I do all of the backroom stuff. <laughs> yeah, so, um, you know what? Let's 
let's start with everything that we need to get done right away. Um, and then I'll decide if I see something that I like. Or anything that's even remotely worth selling, because trust me, most humans nowadays, well, they don't really. <laughs> Their bioware isn't really holding up. Okay. So, I remember that I already took you through this beautiful questionnaire before. However, unfortunately, due to a raid, um, I lost some of my paperwork and maybe I had to shred some to cover for the tax people. But all fine. Fortunately for you, I have all the time in the world to listen to your exact needs. And who knows, maybe something changed. So I'm going to have to take you through this form again. <laughs> Sorry. But you don't mind, right? Because you get to spend a little extra time with me. And that is priceless. Being seen by an expert such as myself, well, <laughs> you know, it is quite something. <laughs> so, tell me, what's your name? Mm. Uh-huh, right, how do I spell that? That wouldn't, that wasn't... With a, with a D? Don't mind those noises, by the way. There's some, um, well, there's some new experiments that I'm running upstairs. Don't pay any attention to it. <laughs> Nothing of your concern, truly. So, um, right, it's your name. Um. I'm thinking, yeah. And I want to emphasize that is your full legal name. Because if you are not providing me with your actual name, unfortunately, I cannot do anything, you know, about uh, alerting any family or friends if um, your operation ends up going badly. Yeah, I've had it happen before. Um, I mean heard of it uh, happening before to like someone else you know um oh poor guy poor guy yeah tragic truly um so i just want to check this is your real full legal name or else you are aware of the consequences that i might have to dump you in some you know unmarked yard right right okay okie dokie that's really good um, and then, right, so that's your name, uh, date of birth, mm-hmm, right, oh my goodness, actually, <laughs> well, you don't look like it, no, seriously, I'm not only saying that for customer service purposes, but, you know, it's also true, with you, I'm not lying. You look absolutely gorgeous, god fucking damn. Um, <laughs> anyways, um, right, and, uh, this is also just a general health check, so, could you tell me all the upgrades that you have currently? Let's just go body part by body part, right? So, let's see, anything... Uh, that you got done to the head area, anything like that. Minimal. Oh, that is really good. That is really good. That is going to be very helpful for me today. Mm hmm. Okay, but you did have that implant, right? Yes, yes, I remember. Okay. And then anything done to your chest area, so that also includes any alterations to your vascular system, your heart, anything like that. Mm hmm. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Mm hmm. Got it. 
you know, I have to take all of that into account because of, you know, the dosage of medicine, antibiotics, anesthetics, yada, 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 you know, boring. <laughs> you don't need to know about all that. Um, but it is very important that you are telling me the truth because otherwise, otherwise we might run into some issues. But I trust you. Look at that face. You have a trustworthy face. <laughs> And since you have been a customer before, you do get a little bit of a repeat discount. So, all right. And then arms. I remember I remember your arm alterations. So we did a few of those. Um, do you have anything else that you got done to those? No? Ah, perfect. Staying loyal, I hear. I like that. I like that a lot. Anything else? Anything from the waist down? Mm hmm. Okay. All right. Well, it sounds like a lot of your bio parts are still intact, so that is definitely going to up your value. You see, the more gear you get, the more polluted your entire circulatory system and just everything becomes just a lot of heavy metals and that means that if we were to transfer even just an untouched bio part from someone that's altered a lot into a person that is not altered a lot well their body is going to reject it because there's just too much metal in there it's crazy what a body can do you know it is crazy but so that is really good that ups your market value by quite a bit and don't worry i'm not selling you um, not without your consent <laughs> so um you don't have to worry about that it's all good um right so okay and out of all of the parts and upgrades that you have right now, are there any that are giving you any problems? Anything that is jamming sometimes? Any errors? Any um, any pain? Any anything that's rusting or corroding? Maybe something that stinks. I don't know. It happens sometimes. You know. Nothing too bad. Mild chest pains. Hmm, that's not great. I'll note that in here. And you would like the blades sharpened, right? Okay, because they're dull, right? You know you can do that yourself for cheap, right? No, I, I, I don't want to uh, discourage you from uh, buying my services, but <laughs> I'm not specialized, huh? I don't know. But sure, I'll sharpen your blades. Heck, throw that in too. Sharpen blades, all right. That is great. And um. Yeah, so with that, I just have some things that you have to sign for me. Now, this is just an agreement that you signed last time too, but I just need a little squiggle on that again. So this here, well, it's just, like you know, small details. You've seen it before. It's just a thing where it says, if you go cyber psycho, I am legally allowed to and to you <laughs> you know and uh, also that i am not liable for any and all damages done to your body um even within surgery okay and right so just just sign there you <laughs> just sign right no you don't need to look at that too closely no you can trust me you know that and for the price that I'm offering you, maybe uh, it's in your own best interest not to think about it too much, you know. In general, this isn't a place where people go to think about their upgrades too deeply. It's like a, you know, it's like a, what are they called? Walk-in tattoos, those flashbook things. You just choose and pick and you're like yep slap it on and even though it's permanent you don't really think about it too deep you know it's and they always make you sign stuff too it's ridiculous <laughs> so just think about it like that <laughs> right so all right now that we have 
all of that out of the way, I would love to know what would you like to get done? You need something new. Okay, well, that's fake. Um, are we talking combat? Are we talking defense? Are we talking just general upgrading? More defense. Ooh, I'm making some enemies I hear. That is not a good thing in this side of town. Thankfully for you, I have just the thing. I have just the thing, yeah. Remember all the stuff that was in the hallway? Actually, something new just came in. Now, I know I've sold you something new before. And how did you like that, huh? Go on, tell me. How's the Lord Dreno been treating you? Now, I know it's an expensive investment, but... Is it good or is it good? <laughs> yeah, I know. So trust me when I tell you that this, this is the new big thing. Now, I want to warn you, it is quite an invasive surgery, but last time we did that too, and you held up just fine. So, I'm not too worried about it. Now, it is from this engineer all the way, all the way in the fucking slums. No one knows about him. No one does. And he comes up with the craziest shit. But sometimes... That crazy shit is actually really fucking good. And I managed to get my hands on one of his devices. They are concealed trapezium blades. Think about it. Everyone will see your arms coming. Everyone's seeing that coming. But from your trapezium? No one's seeing that coming. They get too close, boom, stabbed from above. They're just done. They come from the back, boom, done for. Now, how great's that? <laughs> how great is that? Right. So, what we do is we take out your entire trapezium muscle and we replace it with the tech. It's mostly flexible body silicone that is going to cover up the removed trapezium muscle. And then it's just the upper rims of it are tech. It's mostly chrome, you know, and some titanium. Um, yeah. Oh, it's going to look glorious. If you want, I could do some um, etching details in it, you know, put some roses on there. It would look hella cool, but it's going to cost you. I'm not going to take parts for that. I want to see some eddies. Man, come on. What do you mean you barely have any? You really walk into my business expecting me to give you all this shit for free? I am offering you a once-in-a-lifetime upgrade. Seriously, no one else has this. No one is going to see this coming. Come on, you gotta be able to give me something. Look. I'm not cheap. I would love to be able to give you services for cheaper than I can, but I just can't, you know? I gotta keep this business running. And if I want to be able to keep running from the cops, oh, well, I need some money to do so. Um, hmm, let me think. Look, your eyes. I know, people are usually pretty attached to their eyes. But I can give you a prosthetic one that, although won't look as pretty, 
it'll function just fine. Nothing special, nothing, whatever, but it'll be fine. But I really want your eyes. Mm, they're just so pretty. Just uh, have them. And I know my Bioware. Bioware, oof. He is gonna go crazy over those eyes. And I don't know, maybe I'll take a kidney. You cool with that? Look, you know, you're not gonna miss the thing anyways. <laughs> Great. <laughs> the only thing is, you're gonna have to ease up on the Loradrino injections. Yeah, because <laughs> if you keep it up with only one kidney, ooh, yeesh, your body is gonna give out on you in one day. Yeah. So, I know it's hard to fight that Loradrino addiction, but you're gonna have to do that. Um, <laughs> I need to get my payment from somewhere, and, well, you walked into the store without Eddie's, so you're not leaving with both kidneys. <laughs> oh, don't be a pussy. Oh, I mean, I didn't check this before, but you don't want the anesthetic, right? I mean, shit, you can't even pay for it anyways. <laughs> right. Yeah, so no anesthetic. Oof. That is gonna be tough for you when I'm taking the eye. Mm, I'm sorry, baby. I'll try to be real gentle with you. Think you can handle it? Oh, come on. You'll be totally fine, I promise. I'm gonna be really gentle. I don't want to hurt a pretty little thing like you, but... Well... <laughs> what is it they say? Beauty hurts? Oh, I don't really know, and I don't really care either. <laughs> but... gonna be pretty, pretty nice to be able to dig my hands into your flesh again. <sighs> I remember the smell of your blood from last time, Louis. You truly are a delicacy. <laughs> I like working on you. You know, I'm giving you a hell of a bargain with this deal. Oh, I am. <laughs> You'll be fine. Don't worry about it. Let me get my gloves. There we go. You know, I do have silver hands. And I guess I could sterilize them, <laughs> you know, just by dipping them in alcohol and flaming it up, but this is more fun. Plus, well, quite frankly, I don't want to get all that eye gunk in between the hinges of my fingers, so gloves it is for today. <laughs> now... Before we do that, I have to make sure your Loradrino device is turned off so that you can, uh, well, your body is going to go into shutdown mode, right? So that is going to be your DIY no drug anesthetic. <laughs> it's going to feel really bad, but it's going to feel better than what I'm going to do to your body. So... You know, choices, choices. We're all making choices in life, and, well, I'm doing you a favor. So, let me take a look. Um, your valve was right. Mm, God. Ooh, buddy. Mmm, baby. Look at me. 
<laughs> now that you still can. Your dosage is quite high. Mm -mm -mm. Gotta be careful. I warned you about this, didn't I? Look, I'm not gonna tell you what you should do, but if I were you, after this, your lower adrenals are you just gotta, just gotta, yeah, just gotta, uh, just water it down a little, just go easy on it, you know? Especially with recovery from the trapezium blades, it's gonna be rough, ah, it's gonna be rough. So, um, well, make sure to pick up some Tylenol when you uh, <laughs> get back uh, out there, you know? Hoping you have the money for that. Right, so I'm just going to go ahead and do that. Now, I have to make sure I get my collateral. I'm going to need you to sit back. And you're going to need to relax. I've already turned off the lower adrenal advice, so you should be feeling a little hazy right now. All right. Okay. So how many fingers am I holding up? Right. Okay. You can see, but you're saying it very slowly. So that's a good indicator for me. Now this is going to feel uncomfortable. Okay, I just gotta warn you. It's gonna feel uncomfortable. It's gonna sound really uncomfortable in your brain. And you're not gonna wanna have to do this. However, you wanted this. I want you to remember that. And I'm gonna be really, really gentle with you, okay? <laughs> just uh, don't squirm too much. You know, I hate it when I have to physically restrain someone. <laughs> so I've got this little scooping device here. <laughs> this is going to do the worst part of the job for me. Okay. Deep breath in. One, two. Oh, look at that. Wow. Truly, you have beautiful eyes even from the back. Oh, you don't look so good. Let me patch you up for a second. There you go. Oh, no. No, 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 no. We can't have you yelling right now. <laughs> No, no, the neighbors don't like that. No. Here, here. The lollipop. Suck on that. Suck on the lollipop. Good, good job. Good, look at you go. See, now you are doing so great. I am so proud of you, truly. Wow. You know, I could just leave you like this. Could just be edgy, or pirate style. No, you want the extra eye? Right, okay, yeah. All right, all right, sorry. Just suggesting, you look cool, but whatever. Okay, I'm just gonna, yeah, all right. Uh, yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and um, fetch that for you. Is there anything else you want? Maybe, uh... No. Yeah, I'm sorry. Painkillers are really expensive. Yeah. You know what I can give you, though? I can give you a natural boost of oxytocin. <laughs> I would not do this for any other customer ever. But I have a weak spot for you. I do. You want it? Just a little boost. So 
serotonin, oxycontin, you know, <laughs> all the same thing, right? Yeah? All right. little kiss. <laughs> now, doesn't that just already feel better? It does, doesn't it? Great. Okay. Now that means I'm going to go ahead and move on to surgery. <laughs> You're going to do great, baby. I promise. Just relax. Fortunately, there's not too many nerves in the trapezius muscle. It's going to be totally fine. I believe in you. And well, maybe you'll pass out and hopefully you will because that's why I undid the lower adreno device because that one keeps you from passing out, you know? But then maybe, maybe now you will. That would be very beneficial for the both of us. Oh, poor thing. You know what? Ah, the stupid thing is, I'm not going to lie, but I kind of like it better without anesthetic. Yeah, don't tell anyone else. <laughs> Your brain's going to block this out anyway, so I know you're going to forget, but I kind of like seeing them squirm. Yelp. As my blade inches closer. See? Just like this. Oh, yeah, you're flinching, aren't you? Oh, poor thing. <laughs> you know, if you want another kiss, you can always ask. I don't mind doing it to you. <laughs> Just relax, baby. This is going to be over before you know it. Hi there. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you liked this video, of love and I hope to see you again on the next video.